Hello guys, and uh, well, as promised, here it is. Uh, I'm going to do Steps of Torment with the Battle Mage Blaster, so that you can see you can see this character in action. And I am actually going to do an effective run. I'm not going to clear everything; just run through Steps of Torment and uh, do it as efficient as possible. If I get the way right, that is. Okay, so we got double elites here. Didn't even have time to pop the war cry, and that was a triple one. Got a blueprint, two blueprints, and a rare. Okay, let's go to the next level. In theory, I should only stop to, to kill elites. But if uh, if I find packs like like that, then with a blast or two, they should they should just die. Again, this is on veteran, and it is a bit laggy. As always, that that room was full, so I had to stop and kill. You can use blades around here to try and speed things up, but I try to I try to avoid it unless it was like that. Like you can see clearly the enemy. Otherwise, it can kind of bug along the way and uh, can be quite dangerous. Okay, we are already in misery. Making sure the way is correct. There's not much really to talk about this character. I already explained everything there is to it on the build video, but I am really, really pleased with how it turned out. I really did not expect it to be this powerful. And the fact that I can clear steps pretty damn quick is, uh, well, it's a huge satisfaction for me. Okay, let's go to the boss. And I'll have to stop the DPS and go kill the healers because they can do some uh, annoying stuff. Okay, so that was the first uh, spirit potion that I had to use there. Most of the time spirit is not a problem. Nice stuff from the boss. Okay, let's go open up the door. Alright, here we go. The actual steps of the Next up is going to be the death room, which should not be any issue. I always get fooled by this. There's always a rock in there, but I always get fooled by it. Alright, here we are, coming up on the death room. Right here. Generator. Okay, next wave. Got two of them. As you can see, I'm not really using the, the flash freeze. What I do try to use though is the war cry on bosses. Mm, where's the number? There it is. Okay. I should pop the sphere just to be safe. And that was the second spirit potion that I had to use. And that's it. Yeah. So that was the death room. Let's keep going. Uh, 
Hopefully it's going to continue to go this way. I could save uh, and not use so many health potions, but money is not uh, is not an issue. So I could uh, I could use the the mirror more and the sphere, but I prefer to just use the potions. That of course depends on the, on your playstyle. And as you saw there, that was a, that was a blitz, uh, blitz bug. And it actually, well, this is a bug. I should not be able to move this fast. Let's let's debug it. Okay. So if I did not blitz there, then most probably I would have been able to maintain that movement speed. Yeah, that was what I was talking about. Blitz can be quite buggy sometimes if you do not see the the target clearly. Pick that up. Oh, that's the heroic chest. This is a one-shot chest that it is the first time that I found it. And actually search for it. Oh no, it's it's not a one shot because that's heroic. The one shot is called uh, is called differently. But anyway, that is worth picking up. If you find a heroic chest uh, inside steps, it is worth to go and pick it up. Okay. We are here in Aguish, the last level. And what is problematic for this character is the stuff that comes from the ground and shoots you because we do not have any resist, we only have elemental resist and that stuff can can kill us, that is the only thing that I think can kill this character inside steps. Okay, fenders down there. Did skip field goal. That was not. Uh, that was not on purpose. I just forgot about him. And I already have that. Hold on. What's the material? Get that. All right. We're close to the boss. We will soon. Of the sphere here. That's As you can see, the sphere with uh, with all the bonuses, it, it lasts quite a lot. So it's a good thing if you if you want to play on the safe side. But I'm not the type. Okay, let's go and uh, complete steps of torment. Now this guy can hurt, okay? He he can hurt. So we cannot just burn him down. As you can see. Especially if he does that. Right, just in time because we run out of spirit and well that was it that was steps of torment and it took nine minutes and a bit so fairly effective did not skip all that much we actually had to stop and clear a few times and we also got the heroic chest so thank you all for watching that has been uh, an effective run of steps of torment with uh, with the blaster and uh, well if you guys enjoyed it, please comment and subscribe and I will see you guys next time.